Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Gina and I wanted to let you know a little bit about Perfectly Imperfect Junk Journals. And the reason I'm sharing this crazy picture of me in the front is to remind us that crafting is fun. A few of my friends came over and we were doing acrylic pours over seashells. I used a balloon technique and it just busted and paint splattered everywhere. So it's just a little reminder to remember that crafting is fun, especially when you're doing it with some friends. Here are a few of the seashells that we used. They came out so pretty. Then somebody asked me, what do you do with them? And that's a great question. So what ideas do you have out there? What would you do with your seashells once you paint them or do Mod Podge? Please share in the comments below. Thank you. It's so hard to believe that I started this channel nine years ago. At that time, I was a full-time banker and I was still learning YouTube, but I have to admit, I'm still learning YouTube. But one of the best parts of my junk journal channel is that all the other junk journal channels and the crafty YouTube community is so appreciative. The love, the appreciation and support is just wonderful. Now that I'm becoming more involved with growing my YouTube channel, I wanted to tell you a little bit about myself. So that way you know who that mad woman is behind my videos. So I live in Colorado, but my roots are New Mexico. I think I've always been creative and now I believe my mind just works around creativity. What can I do with something that's left over and recreate it? So please grab your cup of coffee and I hope you watch this video all the way to the end. Thank you so much. I am always finding other ways to be creative. So here's some other things that I like to do. So I hope you enjoy. Thank you. I do like to crochet, but I am not an expert. I do go to a lot of crocheting YouTube channels to learn. But for this strawberry hat that someone asked me to make, I could not find a good channel. So my sister and I got a basic strawberry picture and we created this hat together. There was a time I was hooked on rehabbing furniture. I would do U-turns in the middle of the street for yard sales, but I am over it <laughs> until I see a bench like this one and I knew I had to bring it back to life. My friend Pam bought it because she fell in love with this bench too. I think I'm the type of person that just can't sit down. <laughs> this includes working on the house. The faux stone posts needed to look like real stone, so I grouted them. And then I found that nice post cap too. The baby hats are my first attempt. I don't think they're too bad. And oh yeah, I love making holiday crafts with wine bottles. So please feel free to look at my post in November. I have a bunch of them. When I first saw this picture from Canva, I truly believed it was taken from my craft room because that looks like how I collected all my stuff. But I did purge and organize everything in my craft room. And yes, I did throw some things away. Well, I put them in the recycle bin. This simple statement is who I am all about. I always appreciate when someone visits my channel. So thank you so much for staying with me. I greatly appreciate it. This last page has a lot to it, but it is very, very simple. If you can please like my video and subscribe, that would mean the world to me. The bell just notifies you of any upcoming videos I have. And lastly, please add comments. These comments are worth a lot to me. So thank you so much and you have a wonderful day.